हेलो स्टूडेंट इन योर बी सी एस एल जीरो थर्टीन लैब प्रैक्टिकल एग्जाम सो यू हैव सम क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम लिनक्स सो यू हैव टू गो थ्रू सम लिनक्स कॉमेंट यू कैन सी ओवर हियर आई हैव डाउनलोडेड द क्वेश्चन पेपर सो इच एंड एवरी ईयर यू विल हैव सिक्सटीन मार्क्स क्वेश्चन ओके फ्रॉम द लिनक्स इफ यू आर वेरी लकी देन यू माइट बी हैविंग एट मार्क्स क्वेश्चन बट यू कैन सी some linux command you have to execute so try and execute this linux command okay uh, first for that you need to download uh, a linux operating system in your system you can execute this command okay so i will suggest you go to, uh, through the internet and uh, try to ra execute this command in online basis because i can't show you this command execution because in my system i have window i don't have linux right and okay so you can see write all the steps to uh, format a disk so to format a disk let me show you how you can format a disk so you can see you if you go here in the computer and here choose this option right click on the computer and you can find the option that is manage right so this uh control panel will appear and now go to this management disk management right now here you can see the number of partition right so you can see the number of partition you are asked to write all the steps to disk formatting so you have to write the steps that first we have to go to computer right click right click then uh, go to manage after the manage you have to select this disk management and then these are the partition you may select any given partition go and select the partition right click right click and then you will find this option format go to this option format now you can see which type of format you want to perform right so you can see some option is given volume name you can give a uh, now volume name so in tps format okay so uh, by default uh, allocation of size that you can give from here and will you uh, perform this formatting quickly then you have to tick this option otherwise you can remove the option by removing thi this option it will take time the formatting process will take time uh, if you go and tick the option then the formatting process will not take enough time the process will complete without taking enough time it will be a fast process fast formatting process right i will not format my disk i just have explained it to you how you can uh, write the steps so these steps you have to write in your answer sheet okay and some linux important command you have to go through you can see these are the important linux command each and every year you will have some uh, questions from linux command that you can see so i have sort listed some questions here for you which you can um, go through so in excel file so these are the some important linux command which uh, repeatedly came in each and every year so you just go through this linux command try to find the solution by executing the command in a uh, linux environment linux operating system because sometimes you will have eight marks question from linux otherwise you might be having 16 marks question from linux so there are 40 important linux command that have sort listed from last uh, 10 year of both the uh, that means both the session that is two is two session December session and July session uh, accumulated all the command which repeatedly came in each and every year. So I hope you will go through all this command, right? And let me uh, show you some other questions that might be appearing. Okay, so how you can format your disk that I have uh, shown you. Also, sometimes you will be asked to. write the process of inserting extra memory 
so how can you insert a extra memory in your computer see this question write all the steps to add extra ram that means uh, ram means memory so how can you add extra ram to your computer memory first thing you have to do you have to open the cabinet so cabinet has a cover so first step open the cabinet cover open the screw there are two screw which will be connected to your cabinet cover open the screw then open the cabinet cover then there is a ram slot vertical looking ram slot horizontally added right horizontally added uh, to the motherboard so in the motherboard in the available ram slot you have to uh, fit the ram how can you fit the ram in the ram slot first thing is that there is a notch so you have to see the notch in the ram slot and same notch same notch you can see in the ram so the notch in the ram that is female notch and in the motherboard ram slot you will find the male notch right and the female notch of the ram must fit into the male notch that is at your motherboard ram slot so by by maintaining proper alignment you have to place the ram into your motherboard ram slot okay and you have to watch while inserting the ram into the motherboard ram slot that the ram notch that is that is the female notch must plug properly inside the male notch of the ram slot on your motherboard so these are the steps which you have to write in your copy physically you need not require to show in your lab because they will not give you co uh, computer and extra ram to show that process physically but uh, you have to write all these steps right and see this question display a short list of all the files in your home home directory so this is your linux uh, three marks question so you have to execute by ls command so ls followed by l so that will uh, sort list all the file with detail in your home directory first you have to move into your home directory and you have to run the ls command so that you list out all the uh, file right so so create the following formula so this is uh, a question that will appear uh, from microsoft word how you can write this thing very easy you can write this thing very easily using microsoft word let me show you so just see here if you go and in under the insert under the insert you can find this option equation okay so in the equation tab you can find all this thing thing just see all these thing you can find under the equation so you just go through the question so this thing summation form you have to create so you can find it out from here see this summation so you just manipulate the thing over here see you just manipulate write it down here it is written i equal to 1 right i equal to 1 so i make it i equal to 1 and you just delete the thing over here you just need this summation 1 and y j y j write it down here y j we can see right now y j right y j so this j will be subscript so you can find the subscript right now 
you have to copy the s copy this thing once more okay but this is how you can execute this this thing you will get four marks for it okay so okay that's all for today